WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on Tuesday. Three hours left to go in the trading day. You got markets trading to the downside. Right now, you got S&P negative by 30 points, trading at 3,083. Dow Jones off by 371, trading at 27,411. NASDAQ off 84 points, trading 8483. Notes and bonds, we're getting some lower yield and higher price today. The 10-year up a full point and four ticks at 130.01. The 30-year up points and 26 ticks, trading at 160.07. And the dollar index minus 185 ticks at 97.671. And we're going to start it off with a chart of the 10-year yield this afternoon because we've had quite a move in many things in the market. You want to move. Check out this move in the 10-year yield. We started today off at about 1.84%. We're currently at a 1.69% handle. It's not often you get 0.15, 15 basis points in the span of five to six hours that we've now traded in terms of the yield on that 10-year. Jumping over to the charts, we'll start it off with the Dow. And all of this stemming from President Trump stating today, that it might be better, in fact, if the trade deal with China waits until after the 2020 election, the market taking that news and running south with it. Early this morning, trading above 27,800, Dow trading 27,405 right now. S&P 500 was up there at 3120. You actually trade down to about 3069, currently trading about 14 points above that level, though, as the market's getting a bit of a reprieve. Still down about 1%. The S&P is currently trading 3,083. NASDAQ 100 trading at 82.19. Early this morning, we were at 83.34. You trade down to a low right after the opening bell of 81.69. And again, for some context, it was quite a day to the downside yesterday as well. The NASDAQ 100 was trading at 84.50 early, early Monday morning, and you traded down to 81.69. That's almost 300 NASDAQ 100 points. Gold contract trading inverse in the markets. Gold catching quite a bit, 1484.72. Stay tuned, folks. We've got our man Steve Rhodes coming up live right now with the Trader's Edge. Dave White back in the saddle live at 2 o'clock with the Power Trading Hour and Tom O'Brien live at 3. Markets in negative territory, three hours left to go in Tuesday trading. Stay tuned, folks. Steve Rhodes coming up right now.